like the good sex was to say, I, but I like that though. No, you tell her like I'm like that. Like I'm, I'm really like that. that nigga. I'm, I'm like really that. that. Oh. So like you really nasty. I, That's I fuck, what you say. I fuck but, like that. But we always, I don't think I'm nasty. But we depends, always had that. It good. depends on what you think is nasty. Because oh, we've okay. always well, had that conversation that everybody's freak bag ain't the same bag. Are you are you nasty? Am I nasty? Are you nasty? <laughs> By the way, you laughing, you might be. Well, what do, what I don't do, disclose that information on. on she air. ain't. She ain't nasty. <laughs> well, not this, not your, this not your show. This not so your you're show. Not though. Disclosing anything on air. But disclosing it on air don't do nothing. What does it do? Right. It might get you more. It might get, more get you more. It might get right. you more inboxes. You might get more. Well, we'll you might get quality ask, over quantity. Ask. We'll see who all nasty or not. About if y'all ask a question, I'll say if I'm nasty or not. If I did it or something. Let me find no, out. You know, you know what I just bought? I bought them um, Risha Roulette cards, so we definitely could come back and play. We're going to see. I want to see what's on them cards. Wait, you sit right there. That's absolutely disgusting. But like, no, like, okay, so what do you gauge as like nasty? What's too, what's too far? Um, I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to do nothing with no man booty. Like, I'm not going to do So that. you don't eat ass? No. Okay. You like your ass ate? Yeah. So how you like your ass <laughs> ate? But you don't want to eat no ass. But you know what? I Wait, never been with a man now, who asked me that either. So I who don't know. Asked? Well, no nigga should be just asking women for like the rim That's job. That's wild. Like how asking did... for the rim job is crazy. Bro, I just literally went to go get a chair, and this is what I come back to. <laughs> well, because like, how I... did we get, bro? We not even two minutes in. <laughs> I... The intro just ended. <laughs> I asked her, "What do you consider nasty?" Anybody in the room, like, if, what's your freak? Like, what oh, yeah, is just your for those of y'all watching, we actually record live in front of a studio <laughs> audience. Yeah, <laughs> this is not, no, but I'm saying, like, what's your freak level? Mine is up there. I have everything that says yeah, yeah, guy. You got to talk to the dick. Everything that says pegging. Have guy. you ever wanted to? No. To you know, what's pegging? When you like put the strap on on and you go to pound home. town with him. Oh, no, I ain't taking no man to pound town. You do that. Yo. Be like, nope. <laughs> <laughs> he out of town, fucking <laughs> with his rifles. <laughs> His boot, his booty pink and his booty all brown. Down there at the booty something and they toot their ass like, no, you enjoying this shit too much. Just but they ain't supposed to enjoy it. But I heard anybody on the left side of the room, y'all eat ass. Y'all like y'all ass eight? No, hold on. First of all, bro, she knew here. You gotta be gentle. But wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm sorry. Wait a minute. Wait, wait. Hold on. Before before we go any further. It don't, we, it don't matter. We, it don't matter. Right now. <laughs> Brit, my pie is like a double dutch. If you come in and you don't know what, just wait. Wait till it's your turn. Boom, hop in. Just Before we in. go any further, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another edition of the Death Fresh Show. This is I, Mr. Tone Death. I am off camera today because, as you can see, we are joined by some lovely young lady here and on she got camera. The, she got them y'all means right in the camera. Too. And this in the is back. my favorite spot. And in the back, we are also joined by several other people, including a newcomer, you got a first time, you know, listener, soon to be long time scar. You, uh, I know her. <laughs> it is I, Mister Tone Deaf, and immediately causing problems. Look, I'm just, I'm just trying to find an inbox to find a home, man. That's all I'm trying. To. You're not wrong. Oh, My Lord. point is, I never, oh, as a single man, I don't think I'm ever wrong. That's but, probably why you. But single. I do, I do have like this irrational fear of being a screenshot. So like when I slide in DMs, I kind of yeah. He, don't, he but, don't want to be the group. He don't want to be. I don't. In the group I don't want to be the nigga in your group chat. Like, hey, look at this fat fuck nigga. Look at why he why going crazy out here. We wouldn't call you that. We'll give you. Uh, And then we'll give so you women, nah, cause, nah, women be cause sharing nudes and think it's nah. okay, but get mad when we share y'all nudes. Y'all gotta nah. stop that. Nah, cause I done put me it, in a group chat. They get, get, that is why it is. You gotta understand the key word is unsolicited. So, so you if, still share. but that means that if if she asks for it, it's like, hey, hey, I need to get one off. Send me a quick nut video. That's between you and her. She'll never okay. share that. So wait, wait, hold on. So okay, since we on the word unsolicited, unsolicited kind of means when you don't ask for it, right? That is correct. So if I jump in your inbox with my dick out, that is technically unsolicited, right? Why are you on your mystical right now? I'm just saying. Why are I, you coming in? But why are you walking in? I'm the room just with your trying. Dick in your I'm hand? just defining words. Right now. So if I send you a dick pic that you did not ask for, technically that's unsolicited, right? 
that's exactly what it is. So is it unsolicited when I open my text thread and she sent me titties? I yes. feel like, I feel like that's unsolicited too. It is. it is. Although I enjoy titties. But that's the I difference. Didn't ask for these titties. But that's the difference. Now, you enjoy it. Titties hit the group chat. Is everybody upset? Yes. Why are you upset? You said unsolicited well, titties. Why you send a picture? Because apparently, if I send unsolicited dick pics, they're getting shared. I feel it's like not, if you said. not what Lou wanted to walk in and drop off. <laughs> Shout out to my man Lou. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay if you drop all my No, 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 not Lou. Not Lou. Not, not, not you. Not Lou. In general. In general. In general. <laughs> Let's not put that near to Let's Don't change the subject. Because you're about to give my guy a shot. Shout out to my man's Lou. Uh, for those who are watching live, TZ is doing a backyard barbecue event TZ upstairs. TZ Classic. Classic. Okay. Yeah. I gotta, gotta give credit with credit. Classic. They got all kind of vendors upstairs. It's, like, it's, it's like going, going on upstairs. It's going down upstairs. It's going down. Well, can but, I introduce myself before y'all keep being nasty? Dang. You don't like being nasty. <laughs> you a bland yeah, fucking awesome. motherfucker. Sure, sure, Can I introduce myself? Yes, ma'am. Go ahead. I'm on the TDR network too. You know what I'm saying? And I want to make sure that everybody who watches my podcast know, know that you're not nasty. Between the sheets with Robin Reese, make sure that you know y'all watch this episode. I'm gonna share it too. So your your part is called <laughs> between the sheets, and you not nasty. That's an oxymoron if I've ever seen one. Well, maybe I don't know. But the wild, I said that the very first time she named the dog, I thought it was the wildest thing in the Talk world. Talk about the irony. <laughs> I was wondering. She and this motherfucker talking about Bible hymns. And it's called no, Between the Sheets. My show do be getting nasty. See, you got to tap in. You got to tune in to watch it. You but go. you just told me you not nasty. So. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Disclose that. Uh, That's what she said. Oh, yeah. you wanted them people like, we got, I got to pull it out. Only fans subscribe. You know, the package. You got to Oh, you got to you got only fans? No, but I'm saying like only fans. You got to. You know, subscribe, but I can't just be on air saying I'm nasty. Like that's now. Good. Now, since we talk about OnlyFans, <laughs> shout out to some of my people in the city who do OnlyFans. I support black business. <laughs> oh I wish God. a lot of y'all <laughs> would give me my motherfucking nine ninety nine back because I feel like I got hoodwinked, swindled, catfished. Uh, let it strike, run amok. Uh, come on, Tom. What else did Michael Max say? Give me some more. Uh, old Your school expectations play were not met, man. As a motherfucker, <laughs> dog, like I was disappointed. Which man, you could always Wait, stop but, paying for it. I, I mean, but once you get the month, you get the for the month, but you ain't do shit in 30 days. I gave you 30 of them things. You got 30 of them days. Well, don't look at me, me like it's my, right. you, you subscribe to me because that, that's, that's not what this is. I'm looking. I ha, I go through this with Mimi all the time. You're in the line of eyesight. I'm looking at you. Oh, okay. Don't do that. So when you be subscribing, what do you be hoping to see? Like Only fans. I'm looking for shit that is not on Instagram. Mm, do you got a foot fetish? Hell no. I don't even like feet. Don't put what? your feet on me. What? Absolutely not. A no. man that don't eat like feet? Absolutely oh, not. No, it's the difference between not liking feet and having a foot fetish. Like, they could be okay with feet. Yeah. But they don't no, I'm just saying, I'm I be with you. people who, get, who, who do that like, OnlyFans stuff because they be like your feet. So no, that's why I was asking. If I'm on OnlyFans, I'm looking for titties and pussy. I'm looking for porn. Oh, okay. Well. <laughs> you told me you busting it open. Let me see what you fuck like. Uh, <laughs> and then you not on here fucking. So this is dead. This you can't ask for no refund? I feel like the niggas that I did subscribe because I know them personally, I should have inboxed. Mm. Like, hey, fam, this is not what I thought it was going to be. I am dissatisfied with your services. Yeah, you can give a rating and see if you get your Have you ever back. unfriended somebody because of that? Yes. Like, I'm talking like social media unfriended. Yes. I saw your OnlyFans. It wasn't popping. You lie. I can't be your friend. Simple as that. Standards. Why, why, why do you have standards in the standards. wrong places? I mean, where should huh? That's a red flag. What that is? Why? Why do you have standards? (laughs) No, that's not a red. Well, first, first of all, me dating you, and I know you got on. That was already a red flag. I shouldn't even ban. I mean, but she. She get her money, and that's cool. So, I, I support that, so but I'm you, not mature enough to date a porn star, so I wouldn't even. No, and that's cool, but again, I live in my not being mature about things, so I wouldn't even put myself in that boat because I know I'm not mature enough to be in this water. So if you do porn 
or if you dance or if you do anything of the sexual variety, that's fine. Get your money. But what I'm not going to do is be your back. That's all I'm but saying. But see, men do that. Men be liking hoes, be doing whole shit with like all that. But then they talk about they don't want to be, you know what I'm saying? When not like pick pick a side. What you, you like? like he is picking a, side. I am picking a side. You like to look that at happens, the husband. That, 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 that shit happens often. That, that, you, want, you want the hoe until you want the hoe. You want the hoe. Like, you want to look at the hoe. You talking better. apples and oranges with that though. They, they want the hoe. They want, or they want that lifestyle. They want the dancers. They want All the different right. girls. Think about how your woman gonna wanna... feel, like your woman mm-hmm. who not like her probably feel. All right, let's look at let's look at it like this. <laughs> oh, I'm a sneakerhead. You a what? I'm a sneakerhead. Okay. You like tennis shoes? I, okay. I like love tennis shoes. shoes. I I think dunks are a nice shoe. <laughs> They're great to look at. They come in all these great colorways. They're beautiful. I do not want them. I don't buy them. So hoes be nice to look at. I don't want a hoe. I'm not looking for the hoes. What defines a hoe? That's where I was. Your definition, everybody's definition gonna be different. But what's your what's your definition of a hoe? A definition of a hoe? Yours. Um, I'm not gonna date the chick that I'm not calling you a hoe, but I'm not dating the chick that's doing OnlyFans. That's not my bad. Okay. I don't want to date the chick that's a stripper. That lifestyle seemed too fast for me. Like anything that people will perceive as like hoe culture, like I'm not gonna date you. I'm not going to look down upon you if this is how you live, if this is how you get your money. I just know that this ain't what I want to be. Because we not, I'm not going to be having these conversations like Lance and Diamond. We a- absolutely not. I'm not, I, I just, I can't, I can't be a man in the crib like, you got to stop dancing. Not Lance and Diamond. <laughs> it wasn't no punk ass club when Where you met me. <laughs> Diamond, I spent a lot of money on you, Diamond. That's right. Like, I can't be them kind of niggas. Them kind of niggas are nasty people. Okay, but listen, though. That's nasty work. So say you get a woman you that's... You see why I'm reacting the way I am? Those but nasty if you people. get... So what the fuck is he? Right. Na- oh, because definitely a nasty person. Get... No, no, wait, wait. Time out. The nigga that wants... The nigga that... Da- the nigga that dates the stripper and then be like, babe, you got to stop dancing? That's a nasty nigga. That's that's nasty. Okay, so that's nasty. Let, let me let me clear up. Please. Oh, he he nasty. used he's using the word nasty as both a noun and the verb. In this moment, he really should say that's a wild boy. That's nasty. That's boy. a wild boy. Cause that for you to for you oh, to okay. desire that lifestyle, then tell her you can't have that lifestyle. That's a wild ass nigga. Get the fuck about there. Right, that's what I'm saying. That like no nah, man, my, my girl that's can't be point. in a strip club, but yet this is my hobby every fucking weekend. I'm just frequenting this motherfucker. But that's what I'm saying. If you got a woman that's like square, like don't do none of that. It's like just really like preserved, not wild. Don't like to do all that wild stuff. But then you always look at women that are like that. How do? How is that gonna work? In, and it's still not gonna work in the relationship. Not everybody looks at those kind of women. That's very true. That, most do. Most men. But so, but that's mistake number one. Y'all got to stop assuming that every dude thinks the same way. Just because most of the dudes who are public or on also social media wilding the fuck out like that, the ones that are not on social media, the ones that are too busy actually trying to be a good person, they don't care for stuff like a that. Good person. Yeah, some of these good people. <laughs> He's a nice one. Uh, 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 what the she, entire fuck she was like is that about? Oh, oh, you're busy, though. Too busy to be on social media. Yo, you are you, still looking at pussy. Wait a minute. I'm what? sorry. Niggas always make time for pussy. Niggas. We make time for always pussy. make time for pussy. But it has to be a certain quality of pussy. Everybody don't want the same type of pussy. I always make time for pussy. If my phone rang right now, I bet I'll take that phone call. Because pussy on you are a terrible human ass being. Ass titties, ass and titties. That's like, y'all gonna always. And make if time it's for half that. naked, y'all look at that faster. Okay, but now just because they look. No, he couldn't even say nothing. Right. Because she was to gonna to say it. something. I won't come. Yeah. You looked at her titties. I got in the whole uniform. And these ain't even titties. <laughs> little babies. You said, "Oh, she got the little ch- ch- chunks on right on the screen." <laughs> you mean? said that. You said, oh, you look cute in your work uniform. You didn't say that to me. Because we see we see women in scrubs all the time. Right. No, that's not that's We got to see the if the, is the ass the assing in the scrubs since we're talking about your work uniform. Is the ass assing in these scrubs since we talk about work uniforms. Wow. Okay, well. Yes, no, subject, maybe so. Next subject. Oh, so this is you did so that. Honestly, you did that. <laughs> But the, there's a dip, but like she was getting ready to say, 
But like she was getting ready to say, that there's a difference a of us looking at it and actually want it. Yeah. Cause you could look good in something and we may not even want to pursue you at all. Right. You know how many good looking women it is upstairs? Do you know how many good looking women that's on this network? But I gotta keep my hands to myself. Or I don't even look at you like that because I'm not gonna mix business with pleasure. Why should you have to I gotta keep my hands? Oh no, I gotta keep my hands now, to myself. Look, what the I didn't because there's like niggas that. out there who don't think like but that. But I meant it as in, like, you know, women are like a museum. Some shit you should just look at. Some shit you should not approach. You should just be like, hey, she pretty. Boom, let her keep walking. Mm. What's the not approach? What makes her not approach? Because, like, if you know in your heart of hearts that you're going to do some bullshit, why well, go fuck with her? This is the truth. Some thing. people you should really just leave alone. Every person you talk to, you ain't supposed to get in a relationship with. Some people might be on bullshit yeah, while you on true. bullshit. But some people don't approach single. Fuck some that. some people don't approach life like that. Some people approach life with looking at like as a potential mate instead of just saying that's a potential fuck. You gotta have the con- no, you gotta have the right conversation. Cause I don't have niggas like I'm on bullshit. Okay. Is are you I, saying that to me asking me if I'm on bullshit? Because if you catch me on the right day, I might be on bullshit too. I could be still looking for a mate at some point, but like. I don't know. I right, you just like gotta wife. you gotta differentiate what you're looking for, what you're looking for, and who you're looking at. Like if I go into this looking for a girlfriend, but I know the type of time you own, this ain't gonna work. Cause I know right now I'm looking for a girlfriend. You on demon time. It's not gonna work. Cause I'm trying to be all cuddled up in the crib. You like, let's go get drunk, Casamigos for the free cows type shit. Nah. You know. But I but hey, okay, but I said at? you said, but you I said, where do I be hanging? Say it again. Yo, hold on. Yeah. 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 No, That's what niggas do, y'all. No, like, we like not. Like, real. They think we are easy. No, but listen. Y'all got, really think niggas listen. just easy people. Hold on. Yo, there hold we on. are. Hold on. Sickness. Hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on. Sickness. Wait a minute, though. Wait a minute, Wait a minute dog. Wait a minute, dog. Wait a minute, dog. I, I'm just saying, if she rubbed my thigh the right way, the legs might spread, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You a hoe. <laughs> you not wrong. You doing Cause I'm a hoe too for the right person. For the right person. Hoes are your friends, right? Hoes are. You've said it many times. Hoes make the world go round. It's not that we not hoes. It's the fact that they think we not selective hoes. They think we fuck oh, anything. Hoes with standards. That's the whole, that's the whole <laughs> truth. <laughs> like, I know, oh, no. I know for a fact I don't <laughs> fuck I'm anything. Not because I, I'm pretty attractive, but I haven't seen on, some girl. stuff that I just seen some dogs get fucked. So they do. I'm like, I bet you put a bag over that whole head. Like, yeah. hey, Why do I gotta put a bag? Over Why am I here? I gotta put a bag over her head. Because she was ugly. Wait, 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 She's ugly. Be, be the main dudes they want to turn turn around the girls like, oh yeah, you acting like this and that. That be the main dudes. Who y'all be talking again? To? Y'all know y'all friends. Yeah. I. I don't know what my friends do. We honestly don't. I know, know. what Wanda. Y'all don't have these conversations with y'all male friends. Y'all don't. No, Some supposedly of, men don't talk like that. Uh, supposedly, well, supposedly men don't talk like that. That, my friend, is and the bullest of shit. That is the bullest of okay, shit. So these kind of conversations, you got to have them with the right friend. Yeah, all friends. Like, don't. all friends, I can't have this conversation with. Because I know, like, I don't want to sit in a room with a bunch of niggas who are going to lie. Like, I know you, bro. I know you fuck anything. I've seen you walk out of here with anything. I've seen so, you go to anything. Right. So for you to be like, no, I got standards, bro. I know you. Stop lying. Stop lying. But I feel like it's just, we don't fuck anything. And everything. Oh, anything fucks you, then. But you just, but you just said, you just said, <laughs> what do women, you said, uh, we got to change at what we looking at. So I said that I was done because you know I have a, a track record of talking to dudes who you know Media be in the street. Oh. <laughs> you talking shady like street niggas? Be in the street, ni- oh, be street niggas. <laughs> I talked to this one guy. I swear to God, like the guy I almost thought was like perfect. Like he was my type. He had two jobs. Only had a little amount of kids. I'm like, okay, this a little amount. Hold a on, time out, time out, three, time out. What's a little amount of children? Three, three. <laughs> oh, three. That's, a lot. That's, that's You said that's a little, well, well, a little baby mama. You only got yeah, one baby no. mama. Okay, then that's right. One baby mama. That- Three kids. That's the question. How many do you have kids? Yes, I got two. Okay, so she got two. That's a little to her. That makes so sense. Now, so I'm like, okay, he only got, got one amount of kids. He worked two jobs. 
He was a fucking douchebag. I just couldn't even believe that what? I even let him even be by me. Like, you didn't know he was a douchebag beforehand. Did you long, asked him, how did long you met him like, properly? No, like somebody tried to hook me up with him and uh, we were getting to know each other. I'm like, oh, like that's some you know, bullshit when too. When somebody see you, you, you know, your, your, your his people, resume, you I'm know, like, oh, okay. Shit. Why would you send him my way? No, but listen, the person who hooked me up when it was like, girl, I didn't know he was like that for Damn, real Damn, Tom, either. sounds familiar. So I was like, we won't talk about that right now. I told you. I know. I, I know. told we you. We won't talk about what happened. Fuck <laughs> and go <laughs> about your business. You fell in love. I did. I did. That's on you. Uh, that's that I, cancer I, shit. Y'all stay on your That is on you. Don't put that on me. Pussy, I told you have a good time, valid, not a long time. Pussy was. Okay, how? How? It was. I ain't going to lie to you. It was valid. I hear that. It's it was 20 fine. times like her attitude sucks, but that pussy fire. Pussy A1 attitude is a C, so that's okay. what you average in the pussy like, <laughs> She get a B plus, y'all. She get a B plus. Yeah. All right. Pussy was A1, so, but her attitude was probably it was, a C minus. So she got it like was a one of them things hey, where it's like, you know how your friend, get degrees. you know how your friend tell you something, but you don't see what he's saying. Oh, yeah. He's just saying, don't do it. But you like, and you like, you like, why not, bro? It don't, it don't seem like a bad idea. And he like, it's a bad idea. So how long in the midst of me, like, once I got into it, I'm like, oh, he was right. This is really a bad idea. But I was too far in at this point. Too far in. She was putting it on your ass. Ooh, we, she was, ooh, she was. I discovered that this was a bad idea like a year in. <laughs> Damn. She was putting it on your a ass. A year in? She yeah. knew it too. Because she wasn't like, she wasn't a terrible, like, because we were all like, like we were really secluded. Like, we was just, it's usually just us. So like when it's just us or it's people that you know, you not a bad person. It's when we start being around my niggas, they like, yo, she's a shitty person. Was she a hug? <laughs> was she trying to fuck? Was she was trying to mess with the guy? Huh? She was trying to mess with the guy. Yeah, she wasn't though. trying to mess with the guy. Uh, she, she was trying to embarrass you. Nah, she didn't do shit like that. She just was. Like once you get to know me, and then like the personalities just didn't blend. Like, so my, is it is it one of my personality and her personality? Like, is it one of the situations if you wasn't fucking her, you probably think the same way as your friends did? Probably. Okay, that's the, it's 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 the fucking that the distorted yeah. his, his yeah. mindset. That's what I said. She put it on his ass. It took you a year to find that out, right? That's why he was supposed to be there for a good time, not, not a long, long time. time. He chose the long time. <laughs> Shout out to Wind Down Wednesday for coming through. So did it take you? Was it like the full year, and then at the end of the year you start taking her around people, or was it like throughout the whole? No, it was just like you know during the first year, like you start to see shit. Like okay, she might. Well, that's usually around the time where you figure out you should leave somebody alone. I give people about nine months a year, then I'm I'm out of there if they play too many games. Nine months to a year. Yeah. That's long enough. We Six kinda... months is all you really need to figure out if this person is going to waste your time or not. I mean, her her personality just, you know, it don't vibe with mine. We two different people. And you mix business with pleasure on top of it. We wasn't business business then. The it was Hit okay. The to... Hit the button. Um, <laughs> we wasn't. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Don't do that, Tom. Did one. you not? Did it not make business weird afterwards? It did. It was to the point where she was damn near banned. From doing anything here for almost ten years. Ten years, God damn. Yeah. He made me choose sides. You, you was that boo. You was putting you was putting it on her too. Huh? I did not. <laughs> don't see Tom. You made me choose sides. You made me choose sides, Oh, you ain't doing shit for hey, a decade. Close the door. She might be out there. She's not out there. Is she Tom. out there. Bring her in. You know what, Loki? I do. I kind of like when I get to a really mature place. I wouldn't mind sitting next to her. We had this conversation live on, not today. on the internet. Not today, though. You got some more candy in that bag. I know. He just, well, y'all yeah. stop Where's eating this water? grown folks candy. You I was promised some water. I got chicken wings. Oh, talk to you. Dear Tone, where is the water? Love. Oh, I, um, I got you. Thank you. We got the caramel so, apple joints. Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. so what we talking about now, Lizzo? Because we done with your love day. life. It's real messy over there. My love life not messy. I be chilling, man. I feel like at 35, I'm okay with living in my inconsistency. Mm. Like, I feel like I'm I'm okay with knowing that I might be a fucked up person on a Tuesday, and then I might be an okay person on Wednesday. That's balance. Yeah, like, okay. I'm, like, I'm, think about, uh, like I'm okay with living in that. Fucking on the first date. Fucking on the first night. I think it's cool. 
Because if all I want to do is fuck, whether we fuck on the first date or the fifth date, if I just wanted some pussy, once I get this pussy, I'm gonna decide whether I want to stick around or not. So it but doesn't. That, but that did that give you a different outlook? Like, oh, she let me fuck on the first night. Now she when I was she when, gonna be somebody that I think when, I might be with. When I was younger, absolutely, I used to think all chicks that fucked on the first date was hoes. Won't lie to you. At like 22, you fucking on the first date? Are oh, you big hoe? But as I get older, I'm like, nah, nigga, we just grown. Like that's a grown up decision. If we vibing. And you think I'm not players? You be like, you know what, fam? I'm gonna fuck you. As soon as we get to the crib, I love it. I feel like if the vibrations there, then what difference does it make? Right. Cause you know, for as much as I'm thinking, like, you know, I may not call you tomorrow. She might be thinking the same shit. Like, hey, I'm really not fucking with you after this, bro. You think it's sweet? That's what niggas really don't like. When you try to, you know, spin the block and she cuts you the fuck off. Oh, that hurt a nigga. So any dude that I went into the situation like I'm just gonna fuck him this one time. Yeah, I always end up with them for like two <laughs> years. So years. <laughs> yeah, how, like how y'all, damn, what's, what's y'all be spending the block. Those in the back, y'all be spending the block. No, no. Damn, why not? You can't fuck. Okay. <laughs> say that. Say that. I only have three one hit wonders. Everybody else. <laughs> Everybody else, all he can't, he repeat, can't offenders, repeat offenders, repeat offenders. Oh, she, repeat she offenders? was like, Mm-mm. talking about 20 years plus. Why he can't, fuck, why he can't, <laughs> fuck the first time. Ooh. what did he do to get it wrong? <laughs> <laughs> so, does it does it depend on the experience? Yes, it do. Wait, say it again. But what if we don't, we don't want to give y'all like. The A plus on the yeah, first yeah, time. No, what you no, mm, no. Why do you? Not, this ain't no so sampler. Wait, so this wait. not no sampler. Wait, so y'all, so y'all want top tier dick out gate? Out okay. gate. Why would you? Why would you? But then that's how y'all get addicted. That's to what a you want to be known nigga. for. I don't want A one. Okay, you don't so gotta give A one. Time out. That's B-plus a double edged sword, though. I don't know how to. How do I don't know how not to be top tier? Why the fuck would I lower my standards of myself? So I, why would I have that I, expectation of you? I feel you. That's why. I feel you. But I feel like Ooh, if, if I give you like top tier A1 Holes. out the gate, what, <laughs> you said Holes? what yeah. if I what if I unlock some <laughs> shit that I didn't intend to unlock? Now, what if I find out that this bitch is stage three clinger and we've only had sex like twice? What if I found the part of pussy town nobody's been to in a while? Right. Oh, yeah. You out here just this pussy is great. You made the choice to fuck. Shout out and to the Bro, the may vary. You made the choice to fuck, so results may vary. My nigga, what? But and, I'm saying and, though. Back to be like, I'm acting crazy. You acting crazy. Okay. When you said you was gonna marry me, when you had the leg up, that's when that. <laughs> See, I don't welcome. And then you have to remind them when Please I sign shit on the while line. fucking. Welcome I am not talking row. to you. Okay. I am talking to the pussy. And we may not fuck anymore for a while, but you gonna spend that block because y'all niggas be like. What's up? I had a dream about you. You did? That's cool. How did that go? Hey, shut and the fuck up. I wasn't you there. used that? My dream person thanks you. You are not my friend, bro. You just mad because it don't work for you like I've it do for me. I had a dream about them. You try it more often. You I'm, might get. That's nice. You results might be able to win. Results vary. Results vary. Right. So, since, since it's too I heard that before. So, one time since, I might be like. For real? Oh, okay. Like, but then you tell them the like, dream. But here's the trick. Ugh. You don't tell them to the dream like something sexual. You tell them to the dream about them being successful in some shit they've been oh, trying no, to do. You a real sleazeball. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Make feel good. Why are you wasting my time with a bullshit ass dream? You clearly wrote me to tell me, and we already know what it is. I asked the nigga, I said, what, did I kill you? That's all I was just He said, it felt like you did. Oh, okay. Well, my dream person says you're welcome. I wasn't there. I'm just I saying. Didn't now, up, I didn't I, wake up feeling any kind of way because I, I wasn't say, there. I, you I, have, I have used the I miss you a few times. But it's usually genuinely like I really do. Miss of course. You. Like I may do. not have spoken to you in a couple months. My dream be my dream. Last time I saw you, the last thing we did was fuck. You do not miss me. You're trying to fuck. <laughs> Let's be honest. We Point talk right to here. the we're pussy. Not gonna, we're not, we're we're not talking to you. <laughs> what, once I send this text message and tell you what I'm thinking, it's on you to decipher it however you choose to. I say so I if you feel, I am talking to the pussy. So if you feel like pussy I'm just on the trying phone. to fuck you, I might be. Do you feel like I genuinely miss you? I might miss it. That's on you. Uh uh-uh, uh, you said if I say I miss you, but I missed it. See, I heard what you just said. Yeah, you gotta put put the you pussy on the phone. Me. You miss it. 
Well, it's attached to you, so therefore I miss you. <laughs> I miss you. Just miss it so I could really she, she might have told a few jokes. I know some funny women. So what if you, you make said, me laugh, I'll come so back. One, going <laughs> forward, send a text message, say I miss you, but put the cat emoji that's smiling right behind yeah, it. Yeah, so that. they know it's for the pussy, it's yeah. not for her. You just you just <laughs> message. I'm leaving your ass on red. Tone is dropping she three games. Your ass on red. Why would you Tone, you, you need a show called results may vary because what the fuck is that? <laughs> I'm a funny dude and it works. Got, how many times I got on your ass about writing me with emojis? Who does that? Who does? Well, right, was, right with emojis? Just that's my thing now. Well, you too old for that. Grow the fuck that's up. That's for under 30. You people. want me to use my words? Okay. <laughs> right. Did anybody on the left side He's, of the room hear he this nigga tell me to use a cat emoji? Then tell me to grow up. But you still said I missed you first. <laughs> oh, because I use words and then an emoji. Yeah. Because that way you letting her know that this I miss you, you ain't use. got nothing to do with your personality. You know what, though? Pussy. At first, I used to do it to just be, like, I just be being one. But sometimes when I do it, some people's brain just don't operate. It don't work. And if you, if you see that I'm only talking to you in emojis, talk back in emojis. Come on, man. Let's, it's mental exercise. The conversation. Yeah. Is over. If you send me the eggplant, I mean, water, I'm be like, no, I'm, you just did too much. I mean, it might, <laughs> it might be some eyes, and then if you send the eyes back, then you know, depends on that, who I'm talking eyes, to. Taylor saying, hey, I love spinning a block on two wheels. <laughs> yes, spin the block. You must spin With the, the eyes emoji, just like saying, "Hey, big head." Yeah, that's the diversion of that. Right. Then I might send you some hard eyes. Might send you a funny face. Mm-mm. You think that's sexy? <laughs> <laughs> it ain't about what I think. It's oh. about who getting it. It's about who getting this text message. Oh, it, 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 yeah. it, it's not about me. So, it's so. about who's receiving this bullshit. Results may vary. Of course. Results may vary. See, that should be a whole show. So, now, but you're right though. Is it sexy? Probably not. But, but it, it may be. But it may fit the person. You that, to. Again, no, no I've I've learned how to read the room, and I know my audience. I know who I'm talking to. So when I send you goofy shit, I know how you're gonna respond. Because again, I know who I'm talking to. I'm not gonna send no new bitch fresh off the boat that I'm trying to get to know. Let's boat. talk <laughs> like this. She gonna <laughs> think I'm a fucking weirdo. So you of course it. I gotta use my word. Well, fresh off the it. boat is. Fresh off the boat. <laughs> Weird as fuck. Nah, man. Hey, that's a funny ass show too. Some of them hoes, some of them hoes get over here, act like they don't know what's going on. This is Juan's world. It's a very unique experience. Enjoy it while you're here, because it doesn't last long. Because my mind changed like that. You gonna stay? That was a double right. entendre. That's a like, but I'm sure you didn't mean it. Like, girl, don't do it. Girl, don't do it. I'm, a, I'm not. <laughs> I'm a cancer, so I might be on stage. Oh, I don't fucking. Y'all crazy. Why do people think that? Because it's the truth. Y'all still y'all. Crazy. You know what's crazy? Lizzo calling other people fat. She fat. That's why. Okay, let's get into it. Absolutely why. Let's not get into the fat thing. Let's get into it. I got something to say. No. Let's get into it. She fired the girl because the girl gained a little weight and the girl had an eating disorder and she told the girl, um, you got to go. You gain weight. Which is like, how the fuck you going to say that? So you call me the only big girl. Like, come on now. You call me the only big girl. She wanted to be the big bitch in the building and she felt that she was encroaching on her, her brand. So she got to go. But on top of that, you're so empowerment and all this stuff about your body and uh, everybody being comfortable hope, and all this stuff. So I hope. Body, that, that wasn't right. I hope they get Lizzo the fuck out of here. She ain't going nowhere, dog. Me personally, like, I hope they cancel her. Only only because I, I, dis, I dislike her music so much. Yeah, I just, I don't like it. I choose not to listen to it. It is. That's again. This is all opinionated. This, we sit here for an hour and speculate. Ain't none of this shit factual. I just tell you I, how I feel. I, after her first song, what was the first song? I don't know. Some why you gotta be some oh, song, whatever. Uh, why? See, y'all why don't even great. know her songs. Can we great, cancel so her? Gotta be great. Uh, yeah. We not fans. I, after that, I, I definitely performed that at karaoke a number of times. Yeah, I don't. I, you know, I really don't. Now. I don't support Lizzo. I mean, she, that's another big that, woman to another big woman. I I don't because, and are we supposed to just support her just because she fat? Girls? Well, I guess I, she did. Yeah, so. yeah. No, hell yeah. no. That's like supporting. Liz, no, Lizzo is the fat bitch. Ain't that we supposed to do that? Body. 
Nope. Ain't we supposed to support black people because they black? No, no, no. Absolutely no. no. I hate Kanye. No. God I hate Kanye. Yo, wait, wait. Not too much on Kanye. Yeah, yeah. Yeezys are back. Yeezys are back. If you like Yeezys. No. <laughs> But you, but you loved him before he graduated, though, right? And when he dropped out. Kanye and when he dropped out of school. Now he is Kanye Kardashian. But still. And you're paying for another agenda. I don't, I don't. I, don't I mean, I don't. Has he dropped music since? Like, Kanye? Yeah. Absolutely not. Yeah. So I don't. Care. I don't want to hear. Well, he making too that, much that money. Last album with the. But that's, that's with the my who? Response to you saying where he had that little bang. Or, you know, you asked mm-hmm. him back. No. No, no, I don't. The okay, Donna, I mean, but we okay, 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 oh, not Kanye, but like Clarence Thomas. Ain't nobody fucking with him. Who the fuck? He would never have won a vote. Excuse me for not knowing. Yeah, the black conservative, the, the try to, um, what was it? And we didn't like Sherrod David Clark either, so we definitely don't fuck with him. He was never a nigga. He's a white guy who got a bad tan. He was black. He was a cowboy. <laughs> he was black. Oh, yeah. uh, he was. But I don't think you should just. It should necessarily be a thing. Oh, I'm supporting this. Because I mean, because there's, believe me, there are TV or, shows or we watch you know, to look at. The, business is business. I'm going to support it. If right. I'm not gonna, if it. I'll give you a shot, but if your shit ain't quality or whatever like that, yeah. like, you ain't going to keep getting my money. Of course, I'm saying, though. Like, we, see, that's how I felt about the OnlyFans. That shit wasn't quality. Bitch, oh, I go going to keep getting my money. Then you should probably ask for a refund. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Nah, yeah. Can you? Your big, yo. Big okay, thing. first, first of all, I just Lizzo's just too much for me because you know, uh, literally, like even if okay, so you big, okay, you big, she not you even support pretty like big that. women, whatever, like she just be doing the most, but even some of the stuff she be wearing, like that is just that she just don't be cute. You know what I'm saying? We already be having a hard time finding clothes that's gonna get us together. Like you, you just look at the whole mess. Like I just don't. When she did that to the Bruh, basketball game, she had her. Yeah, like that was, me, just, that too was, that was, that was yeah. just too much. That was too much. We were just talking kids. about that. Yep. She, yeah, I remember that when she had her butt out like that. Yeah, it's kids. That, that, that was too much. That was wild. Like, that was like, like as, what you trying to do? That's the biggest do? golf ball I've ever seen in my life. Stop it, <laughs> John. Mister, <laughs> never mind. When I, it, yeah, so she just too much. It, 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 it didn't go over my head. I know. When she um when she when she do stuff, I just look and keep keep it pushing because I just I just like after she did week. that, I was done. And I'm sorry because I I genuinely love BBWs. Like I love. Hey. But Liz, get you and me, y'all. Get you and me. Lizzo be on a different type of time now. I just can't get with it. It's a, it's something about her that just I just do not like it. Is it because you play the flute? No, but that might add to it. Wait, you play the flute? I do not play the flute, no. and I wish Andre three thousand to stop just hanging out in the park playing the flute for somebody to call the cops on him. Right, That's he creepy. Good, he make good music though. Cool. He's, he's supposed to be dropping. He he make good verses. Bro. Stop. Three, he make good music. Yeah. He just rap, bro. He got an album coming. When that album dropped, then we can put three stacks in this conversation of who's great. The Love Below was fire. Yes, it was. Yeah, I want Question. Yes, ma'am. What's to be for a BBW? What's too big? Yeah. When you search on Pornhub and they start putting the S in front of shit, that's when you too big. When it's just BBW and then they start putting the S BBW, that's far too big. And then there's SS. Yeah. See, See when you, they, you going too deep down the rabbit But I'm saying, she asked me what was too big. So and we, so I'm talking about for you personally. Like, when okay, you start you adding, got, you got your stomach hanging down a little bit too low, or your back fat nah, coming through your t shirt. What, what's like, I appreciate back rows. It's wild. It's a bakery. Yeah, man. And the food bar is a necessity. Honey oh. buns. It's just for Lupa, like Great a chalupa. <laughs> 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 That's a whole that's I got a whole <laughs> shirt oh about the Hoopa Tone. You already know. <laughs> oh, okay. You asked me to come to this shit. You asked me. In 2024, they eating, what is it? Hoopas like chalupas? Crack. <laughs> okay, I've never been with a, with a guy your size. Not that I have, like. You got a, you got a preference? You. Nothing against you, but it's just like. Too much man. I don't know. You feel you feel like two what big bodies shouldn't super super oh, size. Okay, Some so like super like super is SS. Super size, BBW. super saiyan oh. big bitch. Not super. <laughs> <laughs> she on there showing her Vegeta. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <too. laughs> Yo, we are part of 
far too childish to be doing. <laughs> I see why we take breaks because if we consistently did this, every but you Saturday. know when we are consistent, we do calm down. Like second or third episode, we get serious. But the return episode, we we extra childish. It, how many people in the room are like mothers, parents, all like that shit? So we got one, two, three, four. So just two of y'all that ain't got no kids. FTK. You like the, you like the process that make them know, but, but you don't but, want them. Those grow. motherfuckers are non-refundable. I just became a responsible adult like three years ago. What you gotta go? Hell no. Oh. That's I tried a gigapet two years ago. Oh, hey, speak, speak, that ain't gigapet. Speaking, speaking <laughs> of you saying that, like. I was. I swear to God, I like, really tried. When I get high, I like go down. Like I be in my own thoughts. Please and how she that. was like, she just became a responsible adult like three years ago. I'd be like, yo, like, what? Too. What am I gonna do when the day comes? Like, if I'm still here and I got nobody, because I don't feel responsible enough to be in the world with nobody. We've been trying to get what you, you ready like for that, you, but like, you won't listen. Like, as an elder? No, I'm just saying, like. I when people, people, when people, when you, no, I'm dead ass. Kids. Like no, some people, some people no. run into these unfortunate accidents. You start losing family members. You lose Absolutely. your parents. Yeah. Like I feel like I would be lost in the fucking world if right now today I lost my parents. Cause I feel like as even at 35, I'm not responsible as an adult. I know I'm not. <laughs> and I feel like if I had to be a responsible adult, that would crush me. That'd fuck me up right now. I'm not saying that I couldn't do it. It's just like I'm gonna, okay. It's just like yo, like damn. It's a guy how you just said three years ago. I just became responsible. I'm talking about like not living check to check and all kind of stuff. Yeah, like like you know, saying get yourself right, like that kind of shit. I mean, I've always been like responsible to to an extent, but I'm just talking about like I didn't want to ask. And I'm like, okay. Oh but no, some, you would definitely ask. It's just but some like, people like I you're was definitely the person that's like, okay, I oh, got shit. this. Stop bringing my shit. I know I got bills. And my bad, bro. I'll just move something okay, over. I like right, you know. My next page. Boom. So. If so, Florida would have came out five years ago, no, my wouldn't even have the world. Now. The world would be so That's different. Yo, when they Florida said, came out when, when they told me I could buy sneakers with that shit, it well, was up. Really be fucking me up because now everything is coming out. Of the- See, you know, I'm like, damn, do it four payments. What you say, six payments, and all such. What you say, you got that last thirty dollars right the day before payday? Your come on, and then be like, won't he do it? Because God knows when my check hits. Yeah. But I have income outside of my of that's my family, and that's God know when everybody get paid because he a con artist. <laughs> okay. Scamming us. Don't be calling the big homie a uh, con artist now. He is not a con artist, but Jesus definitely likes being outside, fam. So he not. So I can't call him a con artist, but you sit on a pod that we gonna do in about a couple hours every Sunday. You call folks a deadbeat dad. Is he not a deadbeat? Did he not leave his son here on his own? Letting him out in the world. No, 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 no support, no nothing. Hey, he did leave folks in that cave for like three days. No, 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 no. He, no, no. Jesus feel like he needs to chill because the world was wild. Lessons that were taught. Things that had to happen. Yeah. For faith and belief to come. Imagine calling, imagine calling, imagine looking for your dad for like forever. And folks just, he like, he not answering the phone. He don't answer no text. And then he just pull up, put you in the car. You looking at him like, fuck, where the fuck you been? You want some ice cream? Yeah. I feel like this is the conversation they have. So, you want some ice cream? We're not going to go there. But you know what? Even though he's a deadbeat, we got to uh, see what happened to your hands while you was down here, man. That's fucked up. You didn't even fix it neither, bro. Right. He could have sold your shit back together. He didn't left. do none of that. Still holy. I, I heard you was taking care of Moses, but you couldn't come see me. Right. right. That's what I'm saying. Don't do that shit to me. Don't do that shit to God. Do not do that shit to God. God is an absentee parent. Oh. And nobody will admit it. <laughs> you need to heal. <laughs> he needs Jesus. Y'all don't think he's an absentee parent? No, let's y'all read the Bible. We don't think we're not thinking that, so let's go on to the next subject. Y'all, read the y'all know religion ain't I want I'm a sorry. place to be. I'm sorry. I, I, hey, before we you cut these, some crazy ass stuff. Before we cut these mics on, I ask for so y'all easily offended. No, I ain't easily no, offended. No. I know you not. Oh, no. okay. I know, the, I know the type of but I ain't easily offended. So what the is, uh, finish your statement. You know the type of what? Poetry you be doing. I don't just. I. What kind of laugh did you just laugh? I am not. The excitement of a grown man is that's why they that's why women won't let us do nothing. Because when we look at black boy doing. It's never a safe space. Look at black boy doing right there. I don't want to not make it safe. Hey Tommy. 
Hey. Right, right. I love the reaction he had, but I also understand why women say the shit that they say because the shit we do. But I pre- that's the same joy I had when I opened up a box of shoes. I love it. Or when I put a fresh pair on that I ain't wore all day. She got the uh, the salt and pepper version. I mean, but so uh, I feel like Lizzo can't go to hell. Uh, no, she, that's she uh, def- Lou. Lou was printing them upstairs. What else is going on? Yeah, so I said, let me count. Yeah, Alabama. With the, oh, well, they with the, with, yeah, with the white people. Shout out to black people. I just want you to Shout understand to black one. Black one. Black folk be flat quick, white quick, folk. Quick call back. Quick call back. Remember I told you about the, what Joy looks like when a woman finds out her favorite outfit got pockets? Yes. That was Tommy. <laughs> for sure. Clap it up for Tommy. <laughs> Oh, uh, no, 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 no. What? Tommy, you don't understand, though. Ask the woman Tommy, if that shit got Tommy. Pockets. There you go. Oh, hey, all the all cancers? Okay. <laughs> and what are you? About the woman Capricorn. And more about the pockets. It's the pockets, Doug. It's about, I'm telling oh, you, when a woman so find out, I will be in the association. Because <laughs> that little angry bitch was a Capricorn. <laughs> The one that hurt his feelings. Yeah, we opposite of cancers. This is some a whole lot of whole lot. I'm Aquarius. Do I like her? Smart, intelligent, natural, intelligent, natural Aquarius. You be getting natural ghost. Y'all, y'all be going down like groundhogs. Like, yeah, we No, you ghost people. People take us there. Don't you we all have a ghost for you? No, I don't. I'm going to stay out your inbox. It's you a lie. Ghost to me, bro. Okay. Y'all say, no, Thank they, you. I know where I'm not wanted. They are perfectionists when it comes to staying out the way. And really, it's for protection. I am for my You do yours from the crib. Years. That's why. Aquarius. Hey, I Tommy. Love <sighs> I love her. I think Aquarius are awesome. They just, they made it be real protective over themselves. Okay. All right. Hey, hey, Tommy. There's some dangerous people upstairs. Oh, yeah. She's here. Please beware. St- oh damn. damn that's fucked up we both like damn <laughs> my bad bro y'all got a lot going on here at tdr no, no, no. i see he has, he has this, his own problem on this, uh, the it's, show. it's beautiful because I, I like the fact that we the only three niggas that are working mm. so y'all just got a whole variety a whole selection and, and we don't touch none of them oh, okay look they i like that my, i like that the staff at tdr is women it's beautiful you can't have all niggas that's too much testosterone Cause you know niggas, niggas be having their own ideas, and then niggas be thinking they're smarter than other niggas. And niggas is just niggas, and I don't got time for other niggas. Uh, dick slinging content. Yes, yeah, you know, <laughs> pause. We not finna be out here just seeing who got the biggest dick, man. Pause. That is wild. Yeah, but that's what niggas do. They, they really do do that. Niggas yeah, make so niggas make everything. I got the biggest balls. Like I, bro, I did this, but bro, I did this first. Oh, we I don't. Did it better. And that's the thing I like about your TDR. We really don't care about that because we all eat and get money no we don't care about none of that i definitely <laughs> don't care about another nigga's dick size that. that's what we i know what mine do that's all that matters you hit the he hit the ain't nobody worried about nobody else's penis. what you do with your dick is your dick no no we might intervene to say hey man i don't think you should put your dick in that pretty much but if you choose to do Wait, so that's still on you i'm so glad i'm sober for this there is no way I could. No, no, you can't. On the death pressure. show, you can't. You can't. Why? I'm we ignorant. Can you imagine me being under the influence for this right now? I'm oh. so happy I'm sober. God. Yo, I'd have been way off. The the, I'd, have been, I'd have been way off kilter. Tell me where the wine is. Cross the hall. Yeah, somebody go get the wine and a cup. When you ladies would like to go grab a so grab what about this man getting beat down? Grab the big bottle. And I like how you keep yeah. bringing it back. It was, it was, it was, I do. I get sidetracked. Right? <laughs> I missed it. So, so um, where was they at? In Alabama. Yeah. 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 Charges so, water. Water. so apparently it was some white world. people. Can we say white people on the network? You can it's, say whatever we right. want. Are you talking about the situation with Jamie Foxx? No, no. no. Yo, about, and for the fact that we, people think Jamie Foxx is a clone, we're why? talking about the. Uh, the boat. He might be though. The boat situation. They did clone Tyrone. They showed up today. That was a good ass movie. Well, they said Diddy got something to do with Jamie Foxx, so that's a whole nother subject. Oh, no, we gonna talk about that later. Yeah. Yes. Diddy, Diddy trying to. I mean, you got enough hips to be one. Do not drop the bottle of wine. Are you? Tr- are you? Am I? I'm. I'm. I'm every. I'm everywhere. I'm. I'm complimenting people. I'm not shooting, fam. You gotta relax. 
Sound like yeah. the women empowerment in here. Like there's a lot of women. That this is how this is how potting should be. I went down to the, to the hood to the Lapham Park, and I was surprised. You know, a lot of women complimented like, "Oh, you're just yes, so that's that's, like, that's where I'm like from." What the Milwaukee women are coming to, they're finding back to that. Oh, hey girl, your braids is cute. Mm-hmm. This and that, without it being. I love when I hear attitude. a woman compliment another woman about their outfit and that woman immediately tells you where she got I it from too. and she the fact that she did not spend a lot of money on it. Is my is so hard. Yeah. Like, I girl, you look good in that dress. Girl, I got this from Target. $20. Huh? I really wear dresses, boo. So I said, hey, I was like, thanks. It has I'm pocket. Like, I'm like, it has pocket. Oh, I get so really? excited. I get excited about that shit. You, lo- you like pocket? Like you, like you, you got pockets? No, I don't have pockets. You don't got no pockets? I'm a big pocket person. See, Women just, love podcasts. I'll be uh, learning. I learned that. Told you, bro. So you when, I get a, when I get a girlfriend, if she's sad, I'm going to just go buy her some shit with we pockets. We did a whole series last summer about pockets. About pockets. Like, yeah, we'll go buy her some shit with pockets. So you and, then it. I, and then I'll probably put like her favorite candy in the pockets. See, I'll be but see, I did. Oh, so those, those, uh, I'm nice. Those a little Walmart bit. Gowns. He just trying to fuck. He a, he a thoughtful ass nigga, huh? The Walmart gowns should be like. I am. I'm a thoughtful fuck nigga sometimes. Can someone give me a cup? Yeah. Like, well, you want your phone those, you what, what kind of cookie is it? They, they said it's the works. It's from Tamara from Delicious Bites. I oh, that cookie one. fire. Oh, give me a cookie. Okay. That cookie <laughs> is from Delicious Bite. Yeah. That cookie fire. It is. I'm a delicious bite. I ain't even gotta have. So I've been talking. <laughs> you are not a bite. That's my book. Girl. I'm a mouthful. You're right. Yeah, you're not a bite. That is right. my book. Published author out here. I'm a okay, mouthful. y'all. Look, she got the book out, y'all. So you know, tap best in Milwaukee in. author. So I have that book. She beat. I mean, she hit me up to buy it though, but I got the book. Okay. She got titties. Let me get your information so I can get you. Ain't no titties. You have titties on the book because he don't want to be catfished. They right there. No, I was. I was. They're just okay. It's just a silhouette. It is a silhouette. It's nice. It's nice. Wanda. <laughs> we got Kendall in the building. Kendall. We have uh, oh KB's community podcast. Join the crowd. <laughs> community. <laughs> He thinking about community you know dick. Community is oh, Lord. He's 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 a weird boy. Yeah, like the produce section. Bunch of weird boys. I mean, when you're in Milwaukee, everything's gonna be somewhat community ish. It's hard for me to like process. <laughs> See, I'm, wait, oh, the wait, produce wait, section. What I miss? You're trying to process the produce section. It's the LBGT. Okay. The bitch quad. What's it called? Yeah. The yeah. LGBT. It's the produce yeah. section. We call it the produce section. Then, fruits. Fruits. And then, and then the 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 teas are tomatoes, but that's another story. That's a whole breakdown. You figure that one out yourself. The teas are tomatoes. So that's that dream the- you have, and you wake up, and it was like I was thinking about you because I thought about the tomatoes. So back to the fight. <laughs> good call back. See, the fight is is good for black people because black people I, really don't play that shit no more. Like you're not finna. That shit was wild. Jump on us and think we're not finna get our lick back. Like I, just, I don't know what they did. I just the want y'all to understand. He hit no, no, no. Bitch with a chair. No, no, no. I will, let, let's break this down. <laughs> Do you got the video? Hold on. Play the video. Hold on. No, no. Let's let let me break it down. So what Wait, happened t- was on this dock. A gentleman who was a security guard, black That's gentleman, was trying to get a, a, a gaggle of white folks to move their <laughs> boat gaggle? from where it was because they were docked in the big dock with a little boat. So you need to move your little boat over there with little boats uh-huh. go so these big boats can come in. The entitlement of the caucasity yeah, made them feel like that they did not have to move their boat at all. So they commenced to get a little bit belligerent with him. I kid you not, and I feel like this was funny as hell. My guy not only took his hat off and threw that motherfucker like it's go time, he started squaring up with all these white people. While he's squaring up with these white people, it's getting a little rough, about to go down, you know. Then all of a sudden, the boat that pulled up also happened to have a gang of black folks. A gaggle of niggas. They got, you know, it was a gang of niggas, okay. <laughs> got off the boat, and they commenced to even the odds. One brung a chair. The same chair that some of y'all happen to be sitting in right now and got the swing in this motherfucker Bro, like their name was Balls Mahoney. He hit that bitch in the top of her. He head. cracked one dude. He, that dude was so confused. Like, why did I get hit with a chair? Like, you ain't out here causing problems. But the rat, the one where he cracked the bitch when she was sitting down on the ground, because she had already got molly whopped by some white woman. Like, this, this black woman put the skippity paps on her with ease. <laughs> and just had her on the ground like now. What did we learn? And then dog came in and cracked her with the chair. <laughs> At this point, this is when the security decided to say, Hey, we need to get you the fuck up out of here because you do it too much. 
But wow. it was the most beautifulest thing I ever seen. She, <laughs> she, she, was, civil war she down was at the dock. She was sitting on the edge of the dock, and folks proceeded to uppercut her to and the then push her in the water. <laughs> I was like, yo, that, on the dock of a that's bay. why. Sitting in on the, the dock of the bay. <laughs> Watching these fists fly by. I couldn't imagine just getting beat the fuck up like that. It's your fault, though. I gotta see the video. I mean, it's six different angles. I wouldn't too. cause no shit like that. It's like, but after seeing that video, then I was thinking, like, then we watched the fight last weekend. I was thinking about boxing. That shit was embarrassing. I was I just like, no imagine, like, your job is that to, was, like, was, that was embarrassing. I mean, boxing is an athletic competition. It's a sport. Not everybody going to be great. Somebody going to be better than you. But to be better than me, like, while punching me in the fucking face, like, it's one thing when you get crossed and then a nigga dunk on you. That's cool. You know? But for a motherfucker, like, you sitting there physically trying to block the punches and he's just fucking you up because you can't do shit. That's crazy. And niggas openly, like, trained to do this. They both were undefeated. Well, he looked like he didn't know how to fight. You get his ass whooped. That was embarrassing. Imagine just everything Very you do, a motherfucker got a counter for. And niggas pay for that fight. That's bad. that's the sad part. I was rude for Terrence. I feel like I'm too handsome to be a boxer. Like I don't want to be punched in my face. Even in the ring. That's just me though. I don't want to be punched. What's up? Uh, we have people that are waiting on the wine, so could you please you pass it? You got a screwdriver? Get the motherfucker open. It's not a twist on. Screwdriver. Did you ever tell me that you needed it? Baddie, baddie, shot Did you clock. ever tell me baddie, you needed baddie, that? Did, did you tell me you needed that? I figured you knew. I got, I, I, I got. Oh, you a resourceful oh. Spanish person. Yeah. They playing with this wine like this. That motherfucker said, "Give me a lighter." I'm a nigger so I, I'll, hey. I'll make it happen. A nigger Yeah. And I love no, wine, so not, we gonna crack I went to school with a lot of niggas. I'm half Dominican and half Puerto Rican, but I grew up in the hood. So all my cultures and all, all that comes from the black side. So you like fried chicken and Spanish rice. Yeah, so you come to my house and I hope I don't do this with some, with some greens. and, and you gonna, I don't even know what that first word was, rice. but it sounds Puerto fucking Rican amazing. Rice, the famous Puerto Rican rice. Yo, Puerto, Puerto Rican rice. rice. Puerto Rican rice slap. So you do a DNA and Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm my ancestry, I can pull it up right now. I'm like 30. I hope you went to go get African. something to open this bottle while you was over here trying to chastise like, me. Like, I was just supposed to know how to African open a countries. fucking court. Since my boss is in the room, let me tell you how I hate this. Motherfucker. No, don't do that. You hate what? I can't hate my boss. Oh, you said hey. I thought you said hey. I thought you was gonna say some nasty. Oh, shit. You oh said you see, nasty. You, I, you said you I, I, nasty. Know, I never said I, I never said I said hate. She said hey. My boss is not in the room. Right, so I was like, let me tell you how I ate. My boss, <laughs> that, I know, my boss not know. in the room. <laughs> let me tell you how I ate this motherfucker. Pause, man. What do you think I be doing in my free time, man? That is what. That is the question. What do you think? You think I just be out right eating a nigga ass? Like, what do you want? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, a, I'm asking the guest where her thought was. No, I didn't say. I said, I my boss say, is out the room. Him, Let I me said, tell you how I hate something. this motherfucker. And she was like, oh, you ate him? <laughs> what you eating, bro? That's not what I you said. said. You That's said not you what I said. That's you not think what I, I be said. out here gooch, gooch guzzling? No, like, no. I didn't say it like. Gooch guzzling? Yeah. Why would I ask you if you ate a man ass? Like, that makes no sense. I wasn't asking you that. At the top of the show, I said. <laughs> he ain't I, gonna ask you on a I, Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh my god! I thought you. That's said, what you be into. Since he gone, let me tell you how I, I ate. They gotta something. do it right. Not him. I need you down there licking shit like like you eating uh milk out of bowl. No. Wait, who eat pussy right. like they eat milk out of bowl? You'll be Wait, surprised. <laughs> You'll be surprised. <laughs> Worst sexual experience you ever had. What sexual experience I ever had? Worse. Baby worse. 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 Not, baby Not what, motherfucker? As a matter of fact, and, and you know what? And y'all know the person, too, because I'm going to be really petty. He, but, I, I, oh, I don't know anybody. Get ready to hit the button. You don't know. You don't know. You don't I, know who I know you know. I, I, for myself, I don't know nobody. That's how I like to leave it. I don't know shit. Okay. But well, I, I ain't going to share I, that What with I do is. know is that Cookie was fucking amazing. Yeah. Man. Now that now that I wish I was high for. It. Now this is what I wish I was high for. It's cooking. Are what, you, what, are what's you, your what's your limit? 
Cause you keep asking everybody you know how nasty they is. I don't, I don't, I don't do anal play. Just, you don't do uh, anal play on women or yourself. Neither. Don't touch my ass. I won't touch yours. Why? You don't like that? Well, I'm a single because I don't eat ass. You don't. It's not necessarily that you have to eat Wait, ass. Wait, no play. Is that, is that how we define the relationship? No, you can play with her butt. No, I like grab tom, booty. Tom? I'm just not gonna eat it. I'll take one. You, you can play with her butt and penetrate it. You don't have to lick it. I'm having a crazy sense of deja vu. Like, <laughs> she's like, did you say I'm you be doing anal no. bread? No. Do you read poetry while you fuck? <laughs> Why do I have to be fucking multitasking like that? Who I just feel like the slow, wait, the wait, slow it, strokes and the seduction of your no, voice with the poetry might hit for you. If different. she does that, he's supposed to go like this. If I if that sounds like if I can get to a that looks like I know, but it looks like it looks like this. If I can get through a poem, my nigga was out here bartending for everybody. Fucking me right. I better be singing, shouting, nothing should be. That's what it should sound like. Yeah, that's what it should sound like. Yeah, that's what it should sound like. Yeah, that's what it should sound like. What do you mean keep mm-hmm. doing whoever right, so. right, right there between your legs? I'm like, do you think if I had somebody between my legs, if I could have a, not a not a mm-hmm conversation with you, but a full blown conversation with you, they not be between my legs because they all. ain't shit. At all. Damn. At all. And we Literally. fucking, I better be yelling, screaming, yeah. all that. But what I you better can do, daddy, all and that. what I have done, I ain't is doing no one of my tracks. Now, that shit was, I ain't doing no homework. That shit was like. What's the, what's the word for that? Y'all like no like, like an outer body experience? Yes, what? Like, like over like, the I, top. I don't fuck niggas you got to be a cheerleader. You got to uh, let that because the, the better like, that man feel like while you talking to him, the shit, better he got to put me right. But damn, this shit is happening in real time. That shit is otherworldly. And it can be very narcissistic. And that's as far as I go. Uh, I'll fight my nails because when my mother get her nails done, it's, it's a wrap. She's like, oh, this is okay. me. Yes. Okay. But yes, I will not be fucking uh, doing no poetry while I'm getting fucked. But I will play my track if that's what you need to listen to. to no, I want to hear your voice. I want to hear your voice. What if a guy just asked you that? Yeah. I have been definitely. I want you to, to read me a poem off the top of your head I while I slow stroke. The best, the best I can do. What's wrong you? with wow. this? Can I finish the fucking talk? No, you cannot. Wow. The best I can do for a nigga is probably jack him up while I'm while I'm talking. Like mm. so, it's it's just because I'm it's a rhythm and I can get I, I can just. I don't say what want I no say. conversational hand. So your voice changes when you read the poem. I'm I don't know what. I don't know. Let me see. Read something. Mm. That's not the poem you want to read. <laughs> <laughs> that's just a random ass. Piece. Arouse my listeners. Why well, got? <laughs> so that's something you want to do, huh? She was like, that's "Hey, look, you want like, something? You want to be up on can, red to you? Uh, can you get on the mic and say that? That's like <laughs> the perfect sound, but I just need a button to be like." I was half asleep, and I'm pretty sure I was high. And the nigga was like, "Damn." Your voice is sexy as fuck. And I said, it is. I sound like I've been smoking cigarettes since right. the age of six. <laughs> yeah, that marble. Not the marble. <laughs> no. 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 I don't know what a nigga wants to hear. Y'all don't even make the lie appetizer no more. Did you sound oh. like Shirley or Barbara? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> that nigga said, your voice is sexy, baby. Yeah, I've been smoking. I sound like I smoke marble. Damn. The thing is, I don't Barbara, this Shirley. Why would, you, why would you damper that nigga fantasy like that? I didn't say that to him in the moment. Oh, because I'm like, yeah, if I tell you your voice sexy and you hit me with that dick instantly so <laughs> I wasn't my... trying to get it hard in the first place. Oh. You came to me. I don't know. That's what the, see, that's what the other thing. Y'all be coming to us. Why do I gotta maintain this shit? I didn't ask for it. Mm-hmm. I was minding the business that pays me. You hit my line. Mm-hmm. Did you accept the invitation? Are you not entertained? Did you accept the invitation? Once you accept it, once I hit your line and you accept this invitation, it's a 50-50 deal here. I need to fuck. You need to get this hard. Just too much where, time. Where, oh, where we at with that? As long as you sound like Mariah Carey, we good. Why do you sound like Mariah Carey? Because if it's right, then I'm going that high. I, I would hate to fuck you. <laughs> Wait, we talking about 90s Mariah, right? Yeah. Not today. I, no, no, I'm I, about all not all Mariah. I want for Christmas. Uh, no, 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 not that. I'm talking about honey Mariah. Somebody knock it. Ew, why would you want to sound like that? I, I don't I'm know. Good. It just must come out of me when I'm in the moment. I don't know. I'm noisy too. <laughs> I'm definitely noisy. Uh-uh, can you turn on the music? Do y'all listen to, y'all listen to music while y'all fucking? No. Yeah. I, I used to. That's how I used to keep track of how long I've been. I'm weird. Whatever's on the TV when it started. 
And sometimes yo, be background. The first they need, they need, they need to focus on their downloads because I swear to God, a friend of mine when we was in college, when that uh, Sierra song came out, they was fucking to somebody, and all of a sudden your AOL first listen. <laughs> AOL music first listen like bitch you don't have the regular no nope. song that's crazy it's in the playlist though Mm-mm. that's that's not cute I know this dude played for me his playlist I said oh you done this before well, he's been yeah, is he this gonna drive me crazy is this his own music <laughs> what'd you say yeah Pretty, Pretty, Pretty Ricky. Ricky. that playlist was together I was like oh he's yeah, gonna trying to fuck that is not making the sale. If wait, you are trash. Wait a minute. Wait, no, wait. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out. No, I'm saying like I got over there. Niggas was, was fucking you to his own music. Yeah. No, 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 not me. This, me. This is what she said. <laughs> like oh, him rapping. No. Oh, I, that's, like he had a playlist. Uh, he had a playlist of songs. He had a playlist already. He had R. Kelly. That's oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, I got I'm a bunch. Like, oh, I got a dang of playlist on my phone. It's gonna go down. It's gonna go down. It's gonna go down. He go have. You got six bottles of Chris. Your body's calling. She's like, oh. he, I, he had Y'all that. Still R. Kelly he like, had, yeah, he, he, he had body. that shit on there. I was like, oh, this is gonna go faces. down. Man, R. Kelly did shit. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's wow. Hey, and, that, and them girls knew, and their wow. parents knew. I'm just gonna keep it that with the whole. He ain't do nothing to you. Ain't got nothing to do with me. Them That's girls knew, and their parents you. knew. <laughs> them girls knew, and their parents knew. Cause I was 15 and I'm and, and, and R. Kelly come to my school and I was in high school and I see him. Hell yeah, I was going. I'll be like, come on, Clarice, let's go. That's how I gotta go. We don't go 15 or not. I was going. I'm glad y'all admit y'all terrible people. That's cool. Cause me finding out, you know, me speculating that y'all ain't shit. Shit back in the day, wrong. girls was I, leaving I, school to go get buzzed down at UWM by the by them, and they wasn't even celebrities all the way. Them niggas ain't even get to the NBA. So <laughs> it's imagine if they are Kelly, Can't even. they busting that shit down. You, you fucking niggas that don't even play for a D one school. Right, they, these niggas play for UWL. Play for UWL. Yo, where a, is your motherfucking standard? As a woman, the standard. As a woman, oh, how do, don't let a nigga become Greek. Oh, bitches. Oh, you fucking that Kappa too? Oh, you fucking that? You smoking that Sigma too? Like. Oh my god! They have you, a lot. You ain't never had a nigga a step all over you. Stump the yard, yeah. ass nigga. Like niggas uh, who first cross have a lot like, to prove, even in the way. bedroom. And yeah, I want to all stump the yard, ass nigga. They try to overcompensate. Mm-hmm. Stump the yard had all these motherfuckers like, you oh, uh, bitch, we gonna rep the theaters what next semester, huh? <laughs> Still one of my, I saw that shit. Y'all seen how Mary J. Blige? Your sexual resume is comprised of a lot. Y'all gang banging like that's that. Just, Y'all just bitches to the moment. No, it's, not a, it's not a no bad thing. It's just person. you've experienced a lot of different kind of motherfucking no people. Chinese. Did you think that you, you know? Oh, I've never been with an Asian person. Yeah, me neither. No. I want to fuck an Asian girl. Why? Go where you nothing go, there. Just read them hentai books. Huh? There's nothing there. Oh. Right, I gotta find a special kind of Asian. I want a thick Asian. He, want, he wants the, the, the thick Asian. I want a naturally built bitch who look like uh, yeah, lovely like Mimi. But lovely Mimi bought all that. I need a chick that didn't buy it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she bought that shit. The part of your life. And I got no fucking face. I, this is like pure, unadulterated. Like I'm processing. Why does this just happen in you, real time? Real time? Real time. Bro, I'm not that wild. I didn't say you was that wild. Oh. I mean, you said you want a, a, a you want a bitch built like Mimi, but look, it's natural. natural. Yeah, you ain't never seen love. Probably got to be Asian and black. Then I you watched Wild and Find no Asian. Right, just you know. I'm like pretty that. sure it's out there. You just gotta find it. Everything is out there. You just gotta find it. Go to one of them anime conventions. You gonna find what you're looking for. So y'all, anybody y'all y'all, y'all, weird y'all listen to like other bad. podcasts, even though like y'all do podcasts. Like you listen to other podcasts. Yeah. Because I was listening to the Joe Button podcast. And like he was telling the story about Dwight Howard. Dog, Dwight Howard is a freaky nigga. Dog. But, okay, so what do you do? What do you do? I'll tell you if you're freaky or not. Are freaky niggas. They I really are. Like, like when he with a trans or something? Yeah, yeah. Like the DMs he sent. Like, yo, that's nasty work, bro. I mean, everybody has their preference. I don't yes, think that necessarily yes. be like. But when you Dwight Howard, your preference shouldn't be in the public eye. Why not? Because he, 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 he not comfortable. I don't know nobody listens. I don't know nobody talking about his ass. I'm just saying. He ain't LeBron. Shit, everybody talking about no motherfucking Dwight Howard. That's, that's, that's why we talking about him because he be most, fucking dudes. That's the most uh, clout he gonna get. Well, he be fucking dudes that mama, look like women. He sued his baby mama for a million dollars on basketball. Why? Oh, who? He's done. Don't nobody care about him. Wait, who's his ex wife? I don't know. His baby mama, Royce, the cheerleader. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He sued her for a million dollars because she said his he name on air. Like, boy, watch out. 
Oh, that's Dwayne Wade. Jesus, that, you right. The White Howard is a guy with the big shoulders. Oh, he's yeah, and he like he like other he niggas. He like other niggas with big that's shoulders. Buff, that's yeah. My man, my man, my man. Buff, when Buff is when Buff is enough. Uh, that's crazy. I just I don't know. I mean, I don't judge, but he got big shoulders, but he ain't blocking. It's, so has he it's, 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 So did he say that he knew that that was a tranny? Yeah, yeah. most of um, them know. You can't. The niggas know. that fuck trannies here know that they're transgender. You can't not know. But I'm saying though, like, why would you be in by DM in a tranny? They absolutely they do. don't know I'm responding to you. <laughs> it was the it's the noise you made. They these motherfuckers got me on camera. Don't know that they do. They do. Niggas be dead boning. There's nothing that people do that they be fucking people. tomatoes. So would you do Kinks, a, all kind of shit? So like, would you do a threesome with, with another a, guy? No, nah, I don't think I'm mature enough. That's not well. It's a threesome, but that's a train somewhere in life. No, it's not a train. <laughs> nah, I can't. Now nah, me and two is the two the dudes room? gonna be touching each other? No. Or is they gonna? Because that's a threesome. We gotta dead. interact with each other. Because if he running a train, I heard a dude say like, "Yeah, I run a train with my bro, but." Right, like if if we just happen to be in the same room and you fuck then I fuck, that's a trap. I feel like for it to be a threesome, we all gotta interact. And I'm not but, touching okay, my... you're somebody's penetrating and somebody she's giving somebody oral. That's part of the three way. I don't want to be in that's a room. That's running the train, I personally though. don't want to be in a room with my dick out and my bro bro. That's just me. See a lot of guys saying that now, but like back in the days, they'd be like, "Yeah, yeah, I'm cool with that." Yeah. Technically, saying that it's a train, but then now they're like, "I don't even want to do that with another nigga." And yeah. the same reason, like, I yeah. When you, I feel like when you look back at a lot of shit that we did in life, like at like 16, 17, you look at yeah, it now, you ain't gonna do we it. We are yeah, fucking now. nasty people. No, I got nastier as I got older. Like. Just like, and then like, when you look at like what cancel culture is and then like what's appropriate, what's not appropriate, it just makes you think about shit. Like, being 16 in the summer, Brody hit you on the phone. Hey, what you doing today? Nothing. Let's go by this chick house. It's just, it's two niggas and one bitch. Now, even though I'm not here for nothing, I just tagged along with my guy. It, now it looks funny in the light. Like, shit like that get frowned upon. Like, why is it two niggas? Shit like that is cool. It's, it's, you know, and I don't want to be in no situation to be blamed for anything. Again, I just told y'all earlier, I don't want to be no screenshot. That's why when I slide in inboxes, I keep it real minimal. Until you get the number. You got a text app. And even until she get until she send him the, the egg sign emoji, then he send the pic. I don't I don't just be out. How long it take you dick. to send a dick pic? I don't send dick pics. Oh, okay. That's one thing I could that's one thing I know for sure that no one will ever find is my dick on there. That's an absolute no. Mm. So what you be sending? I don't want a dick pic. I don't send dick pic. I gotta. I, I'll be like, mm. I don't know. it's kind of like, not saying perverted because it's a dick and I'm a female, but it's just like I'll be like, ugh, like you sat here and got it hard and took a pic and then sent it to me. Like I'll be like, and I'm pretty sure it beat the shit out of that because once it's hard, like, yeah, like you I, might as well. If it's my man, I'm like I'm on the way. Like I, I don't see nothing wrong with it. <laughs> I'm like, no, but I'm saying if you wake up in the night. Yeah, if it's like, just a random dude, here. I'm like, you're get so up nasty. Here or something like that, but not no like. No, niggas just two o'clock in the afternoon. Spank like, his meat. What you doing? Because like, nah, I, yeah. like, I used to, yeah. When I, if I'm in a relationship, send me a picture. I'm thinking about right. You. See, relationship mm-hmm. is different than just casual, and then know, everybody it. swapping news like fucking Pokemon. Cards. You can keep it. Uh, I, I'll pass. That's a that. big difference. Well, you can I did not. They said they had to go. The conversation got real tame. Oh, so got tame I left. I see what you mean, tame? I mean, it calmed down. It's yeah, because we getting a little, you know, mosey wosey up in here trying to figure out how nasty you are. Right. He, he, I'm he, not. He, you steady with to you nasty, you nasty, nasty, but he mom? didn't say his level nastiness. I'm chilling, bro. I'm not nasty. You not nasty. I think I'm pretty vanilla. Uh, vanilla. That's why you. That's why you single. Damn. I'm single because I'm vanilla. Because you not nasty. Do you lick toes? You ain't answer my question. Who the, I just yeah, told you. I just so told you. You said you don't got no foot fetish. You just say you don't lick toes. Them two different things. I'm not. Why are you trying to make I'm my boy? So I'm not a person. foot person. Why? I appreciate pretty. <laughs> She's like, I need you to be. Like, <laughs> I'm trying to help you out. 
Females love that. No, no, is no, that ma'am. is that what no, you ma'am. like? No, please don't put your tongue nowhere. No, are you what? are you projecting the things that you into you across the side? No, no. that's mean, what I feel like. I ain't gonna say I don't like it because I don't have a motherfucking fucking stick their thumb in my ass and suck my toes all at the same time. That is, I'm, I'm here for that. I'm here for that. That's that's the holy trinity right there. But but and I'm not saying that I don't like it, but. It's weird because I like it, but if you have a fetish, like I, I met this guy one time, oh, plenty of fish, a couple of years ago. We vibing, we vibing. You be out. on the plenty of fish years ago. Okay. okay. <laughs> so after my failed marriage, don't look for her on the I'm truth. just going to ask her what her Facebook is and find her there. <laughs> but listen, right? So I go to his house, we vibing, and then, you know, he got some. When I come in the house, he's literally like, Take your shoes off. I'm like, okay. Well, sometime I took my sandals off. He had some other. Sh- I was like, okay. You know, I understand. You know, people don't like people walking outside. Mm-hmm. No, he had like some fancy ass house shoes and shit. And he was just like, now put these on. And he's like, put your foot up. I'm like, oh, okay. Like this is getting kind of weird. Then he had some rocks on the table, and I was like, you know, I moved the rocks. I think I was finna roll or something. I moved the rocks. He's like, don't touch those. Don't touch those. I'm like, um, okay. So now you got a feet fetish and a rock fetish. He took these rocks to the bedroom and put them underneath his um pillow. Prosperity. No, fam was rubbing the rocks. He, he special. Yeah, see stuff like I mean, but you know when niggas is weird. Oh, you got a feet and rock fetish? That's no. Uh-uh. You, st- you still fuck? No, hell no. I'm like, I'm oh, like, I was gonna say know. like if you see that's where men and women are different. Because if I came all the way over here, Mm-mm, I gotta. Go. I'm probably. Hey, still. I definitely hit one of them. Hey, uh, come pick me up. Say hey, I gotta go. Man, so happened. I'm go. probably still gonna fuck. No, Mm-mm. I may that never. Was, I, I'm sorry that you even had that experience because that would weird me. Yeah, I may I never. Mean, yeah, but I'm saying like, said like y'all in the moment, y'all just being yeah, nasty with no each other. Then like, you, the he slip your toes in his mouth. Like that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I'm like, chicks no. Chicks be weird too, though. What chicks? What what's the weird stuff the chicks do? Uh, uh, you no, know, don't, don't get silent. You now. had your toes licked. Don't no. get silent now. Well, I did go over this one. I gave her the benefit of the doubt though, because like she had just moved, but like she had been in this place for like six months and didn't have no furniture. Yeah, but that's not weird. That's sexually. weird to you. Maybe she can financially afford it. That's not weird. We're talking about some sexual stuff. Oh my gosh! I just I thought this was. She a like play. I ain't gonna put suit. That yeah, that's, that's a red flag. I, did I, she have a bed? Why you inviting people did over? She have a bed or yeah, bed? like why you inviting people over here? All we can sit on your Did bed. you still fuck? Did, did I? We not. Um, Did you just, still fuck? She's, yes. She's she's oh. she talking about that. She so you still had some sexual activity. <laughs> I did. I ain't gonna lie to you. With the with the, with the space dick. with no furniture in mm-hmm. it. on the bed though. She had a bed. Oh. Yeah, I sat on it. It wasn't bed. an air mattress. Right? No, it wasn't air. It was okay. an actual bed. Okay, so she, she, bed. so that's all you really needed. Yeah. To get my dicks, I guess. So you wouldn't fuck. You need a couch. You need a couch. She had a bed. Right. Versus the bed. It wasn't my intent to. What's her bed's on crates? That's why you ain't fuck. No, it was on the floor. Like so she, why uh, you ain't fuck? Y'all wasn't going nowhere. Y'all was down there. I just, I just walked. Maybe you have to get up from down there. That's, 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 yeah. You gotta stop dropping roll. Man. You gotta just roll. Well, Do you know? First of all, I'm tall. Man. So sitting on really low things already. Like, all you have to do is lay back. But how? I'm, I gotta get up. And I gotta get up. I gotta go home. I gotta leave. Just rolled off the thing. So, How would you feel if you walked in a room and seen a nigga just rolling? It? Like, come on, bro. It's just why certain, am I walking? It's in just that? certain optics that <laughs> women gonna look at you like, and be like, "Yo, bro, what you doing? doing? Like, really? That's yeah, what you want? Def- definitely gonna be like this, roly poly ass." Right. Like, so for me not <laughs> wanting to be here because you ain't got no furniture, the same way you gonna look if what's I roll to get off what's the bed. The head worth I'm it, like, bro. can you step out for a second? Was the head worth the mattress being on the floor? It was decent. It wasn't. I go back because I didn't go back. I feel you. We finna cry. Right, you yeah, all right? What the fuck you me. looking at me like that for? Because when you said I, right, and the way you talk, wrapping it up could either lead to the end of the show, or you finna talk about I finna start wearing condoms and sex and shit. You, you, you a wild boy, so I gotta figure those hmm. things out. With he you. ain't wild. Well, first he of is all, not wild. He is of, not wild. I won't say I'm wild. I think I've done some really like some what? irresponsible shit. shit. 
what, talking like, going shit, on? Lying. Yeah, shit like that is irresponsible. Like, I don't think I'm wild. But you came in the conversation of the show, like, oh, how low level nasty, this and that. And then you, you ain't like, even nasty. I don't have a level. I didn't say I was nasty. I was asking the room. No, you said I am like the, po- was, you I am the you podcast. This is a Rewind podcast. to the front. He said, well, he we was interrogated nasty. you now because you yeah. have deceived us like OnlyFans. Right. You should oh. get your money back. <laughs> you are not nasty. Results may vary. Oh. <laughs> take, Keyword of the day. Take a special person to pull it out. Pause. Oh, my. Oh, that being okay. said, we have come Yo, is that the name of this episode? Revol- results may vary? Yeah. Just yes. You're welcome. You're welcome. Results may vary. With that being said, we've come to the end of this episode. I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in on this train wreck of a day. Uh, <laughs> Not a train wreck. No, nah, it was No, no. A, a boat crash. Not a boat crash. Yes, boat crash. It's called Back to the Story. Um, make sure you check us out on all our streaming platforms. That's Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, or wherever you see your podcast at. Uh, Juan, are we taking a break next week, or are we back in full force? What's next week? Nothing. Nothing? we probably be back. All right, so we'll be back next week. Maybe a little bit more wild. Maybe not. With that being said, I'd like to thank the host a, of Between the Sheets. I'm going to have a wife by the time we get it's back here. Me. And of course, Miss Britt Nicole, who's always welcome to join us. And definitely want to check, uh, say thank you to all the ones who sat in on our live episode in the building for a very small but yet intimately ignorant episode. Intimately ignorant. That's gonna be, <laughs> that's gonna be our tour. Intimately ignorant. Intimately ignorant. <laughs> I'm with you. All right. With that being said, people, we are out of here. Peace. <laughs>